Team Coffee Shots Squad! Yan ah! Sa Team Coffee Shots, mga ka-teammate ko si Mike Jester, Bon Jappet Membrere, kapitan namin, John Steven Roga, tsaka yung isa namin na hindi, nag, hindi na nagbabike, si Labo. Bumalik ka na ng bike, miss ka na namin. Yan ah! Ikaw sir! Shout out sir! Shout out! Shout out rin kuya si Team Coffee Shots! Kami dalawa! Oh, ayun oh! Maraming salamat ha! Thank, Thank you very much! Mga bayaw! Iona! What's up mga bayaw! I'm here today at the Rides Bicycle Shop here in Quezon Boulevard, Quiapo, Manila. Today, we will be checking out Sean's latest stocks. Today, which is uh, August 20 to 2022. It's a Saturday today, right? Yes. So we will be checking and updating you with her latest stocks, especially on her bicycles and also in all the parts and accessories. All right, let's go. Iona, what's up, mga bayaw? So I'm here today with uh, Sean, of course, the owner of uh, Rides Bicycle Shop. How are you, my friend? I'm fine, I'm fine. So today we will be updating you with her different stocks right now. Currently, you have this, uh, what do you call this? Garuda Fixie? Yes. Is this the Chromoly Steel? Yeah. How much is this one? 3800 3, 3, It's very cheap, my friends. So if you need like a budget bike, you want it just to go to work, or you know, bike to work or anything that you wanted to do with a bike, this is just 3,800, it's very cheap. And this one is also a fixie by uh, Beta, no? The difference between this one, the Garuda and the Beta Fixie is this one is a uh, drop bar. The other one is more on the handlebar side. So this one is how much? This one, why is this more expensive than the other one? Uh, I think uh, this is very good enough for to to compare okay. Yeah. And then uh, next one we have here, which is a uh, MDS. This is like an alloy road bike, two by seven speed. And then uh, the STI is by L2. It costs nine thousand pesos. If you wanna look at the bike itself, dual brakes. Dual brakes. Oh, okay. So there is a brake here, and there's also brakes here. Is this alloy? Yes. It's an alloy frame. So I think in case you wanted to purchase this one, so MDS costs 9,000 pesos. Sean, this one, Pro we have here the, this is actually the latest, latest version, yes. right? This is the Pro Max PR30. As you can see, it's very colorful. So it has the apple green color and the metallic blue. So this is like 2 by 7 speed, FCI by L2, L2 RD and FD. This costs 9,000 pesos only. Alright? By the way guys, if you wanted to purchase a bike here at the bicycle shop, everything is negotiable. Okay? So don't worry about it. Just ask for our main man here, Sean. Okay? What else? Vera Half Moon. This is 2 by 9 speed. Okay? How much is this one, Sean? 13.5. So this is 2 by 9 alloy frame, drop bar, STI. And then Ignite is the STI. The saddle is very nice as well. So this is how much? 13.5. 13, then they also have the Spunker Gulliver R4. So this one is how much? Uh, 12,000. 12, okay. So again, prices are still negotiable. Do you have any other colors aside yes. from this one? Yes, we have a lot of um, stocks. Stocks, okay. 
So if in case you wanted like different colors, they have. So just try to ask the person on duty, okay? Then this one is the Tosec Chester 2.0. It's also 2 by 9. This is how much? Um, 11.5. 11.5. 11.5, this is last unit? Yes. This is last unit already, my friends, okay? Beside him is one of the budget bikes here, which is the Rhino budget bike, 3x7 speed, tunnel tire. It only costs you 5,000. Wow, this is very cheap, 5,000. Okay, Rhino, MTB. Is this 26? Oh, this is a 26 size of MTB. Alloy? Oh, chrome only steel is the frame, okay? If in case you wanted to purchase this bike, especially for those people who are traveling, you know, bike to work, or people who wanted to to join Grab Food and Food Panda, this is a perfect uh, bike for you, all right? The other one, the budget bike that they have is 5,000 as well. This is, uh, the brand is Jackal. So it's also 5,000, okay? Same specs, but the difference is Rhino is internal cabling already, chromo is steel, Jackal is not. So the cables are here underneath. That's why, that's the only difference that they have. But when it comes to the specs, they're all the same. Now we also have this budget bike alloy here by Rhino, 27.5, 3 by 7, 6,500. Very nice color. Do you have a lot of stocks here? This is 27.5 alloy frame. Then budget alloy for 29er, they have here 7,500. Huh? Lucky 7. The brand is Lucky 7. Okay. Alloy frame. And then this is a 29er bike. Still a combo shifter. So if in case you want to upgrade this thing, you may do so. They also have hydraulic brakes if you wanted to upgrade this thing. Just ask for a discount, no? Every bike that you have seen so far so good are all negotiable. Okay? And then the next bike is Romax. PM16. This is a 1x8 bike. This is 27.5. 26. So this is a 26-year bike. How much is this one? 6.5. 6 wow, this is only 6.5? Yeah. This one is very nice. Last unit. Huh? Last unit. Last unit. Ah, okay. That's why it's 6.5 because this is already the last unit. So if in case you wanted to buy this bike, this is still available, guys. So please try to uh, check on the comment section and also on the description page all the details of Price Bicycle Shop so that you may be able to contact them, okay? Next bike is Promax PM18 Plus. This is actually the newest uh, PM18 Plus. Why? It's because the difference between the, the previous PM18 is that one is mechanical brakes. But now, what they have is a PM18 Plus. It's because it's already a hydraulic brake system. That's the only difference, okay? So if in case you wanted to purchase this bike, how much is this one? Um, 8.5 8.5 8.5 and it's still negotiable Do they have freebies? I'll try Okay, so she will try it if it, yeah, it depends So if you could ask for freebies or other uh, stuff that you wanted to have and discounts Just try to tell Sean that you have watched this on my channel which is Dinoboy TV, okay? This bike is the Crosta, no? 1 by 12 so this is actually one of the best selling bikes right now, Prosta. And it's an air shock. And then Shimano MT200 is hydro hydraulic brakes. Shimano Diore, Halotech Craft. So this one is how much? 24. 24K. Do you have any other colors for this one? So they have a lot of stocks here. Red and green, they still have it here. If in case you wanted to purchase, just go here at Rice Bicycle Shop. And then they also have a budget folding bike. So this budget folding bike only costs 5,000 pesos. Why? Because this is still chromoly steel. It's not yet alloy. But the rim size is size 20. Okay? The brakes are still mechanical brakes. So if you wanted to upgrade this one, you can do so and upgrade it with hydraulic brakes. Alright? And then beside him is, of course, my favorite bike. <laughs> this is the Beta Fry. Okay? Now, I'm too biased to say that, but this is my favorite bike. No? This is Beta Fry. They have different colors here. They have red. They have blue. They have this one, which is the primer gray, which is my favorite bike. And they will not sell this because they will give it to me. Okay? As 
a freebie, right, Chan? You'll think about it. <laughs> so this is a very nice bike. Honestly, this is one of my favorite bikes. Uh, if there are other subscribers who wanted to give money to my Zcash account, you may do so and send money to me so that I may be able to buy this Beta Prime, okay? <laughs> Just joking, guys, okay? Anyway, the price of this Beta Prime is how much, Sean? 11? 10,500, okay? But for Bayaw, they will give this uh, bike for free, no? No? And that's a scam. <laughs> so the difference between these two folding bikes is this bike is more on the steel side. This one is actually an alloy T6061 T6 alloy frame, okay? What else is the braking system is hydraulics, hydraulics by uh, Camros. And then what else? This is steel, this is steel, this is steel. So you just may, uh, you may just uh, upgrade this thing. But you see, as you can see with the, this uh, folding bike, it's very nice, no? So they have different colors. Purchase it here, okay? What else? They do also have road bikes here, like this one. This is what? Huh? This is the Spunker Zagato R7, R7 no? I already have a bike check for this one. So if in case you wanted to know all the specs and all the necessary details for this bike. So just try to check on my playlist. You can see all the details about this Spunker Zagato, okay? And this cost how much? 145. So this is still negotiable, okay? Beside it is uh, this is the Beta Half Moon Hydraulic Caliper, okay? So these are the specs for this bike. It's very nice because it's also an apple green color with a combination of gloss black, okay? And this is how much, Sean? 16,000, okay? And still negotiable. Then, they also have here the Beta Placard. That is one of the uh, you know, trophy bikes of the Beta Keeper Edition. So if in case you wanted to purchase this bike, uh, this costs how much, my friend? 24. 24K and still negotiable. Beside it is uh, the Java Siluro 3, okay? So they have this bike. I already have the the bike check for this Java Siluro 3. They have three colors here. They have black, they have white, you have silver? Yes. Yeah. Black, white, and silver. They have it here. Okay. I also have my uh, bike check for uh, Java Siluro 3. If in case you wanted to purchase this bike, you can uh, come here at the uh, Rides Bicycle Shop so that you may be able to avail the discount here. So it's a very nice bike and it costs you around 28000 You know, But the price is still negotiable. As you notice, no? We already seen the difference of this uh, store because they have renovated it. Before it was just a small room, but now, you know, this is just a dirty stock room. But now they turned it into a uh, nice showroom, no? So everything that you wanted to know about bikes like this one, so they still have this Avia. So I think this is the imitation of Avia, no? <laughs> Avia. So it costs you around 9500 no, here are the spec. It's still one by nine. Oh, this is a Chinese version. Then the the real Avia is a Taiwanese version. <laughs> it's I. Mm -hmm. This one is Spunker. How much is your Spunker? Twelve five. This is Spunker what? Explorer GT. Explorer GT. And then the wannabe Avia. And then this one is the Tosic Navigator. How much is the Tosic Navigator? Okay, 14,000 only. Wow. Napakamura nito, no? This is very cheap. 14,000 for a last unit. And then beside it is actually the Beta Comptail 1x10 hydraulic. So they still have it here. The Beta Comptail is how much, Sean? 12.5. 12.5. They also have the Spunker Tyron. So they have it here. The color blue. Do they still have any other colors for Spunker Tyron? Last unit. So how much? 13.6 and then here this is the Spunker Coleman 2.0 which one? it's uh, twin or uh, carbon oh I'm sorry so it's a wrong tag but uh, <laughs> this is the Twitter 
full carbon. No? MTB. This is a 29er MTB. How much is this one, Sean? 38,000. Wow. Carbon Lodi. What else they have here? This is the Pinewood Hellcat 7. No, Stripe Trail 2. Stripe Trail 2. They have it here as well. How much is this one? 24. 24. What bike is this one, Sean? Tosic Terminator. Tosic Terminator. Alright. How much Tosic Terminator? 11.5. 11.5. Okay. Here, we have the uh, Pro Max PM17 is how much? 7,000. With helmet. 30C of Alan. Okay. What else? Tosic Brandon 1.0. These are the specs. So they have it here. How much Tosic Brandon? 11. And then this one? This is Homer. Wow, it's nice. How much is this one? 16. 16K. It's written there. Stupid. Try to read it. <laughs> what is? And then this one is Tosek X Force. I do also have a bike check for this mountain bike. If in case you wanted to know the specs and all the necessary details, try to look into my playlist. You may be able to look, see my uh, bike check for this one. Okay. How much Tosek? 10.5. And lastly, they have here the Beta uh, Rose Tail, right? And this is uh, 15,500. Okay. So they also have other bikes here, like uh, BMX bikes. So I also have a bike check for this one, this BMX. So they still have red color and black. If in case you wanted to purchase this one, how much is the BMX on? Uh, this is 3.5, the red one. This one, that one is 4.5. This one is 4,500. They do also have Phoenix uh, road bike here, and it's 8,000. So this is a manual uh, shifting, and it only costs you 8,000. No? But everything is Shimano parts. Okay. They also have uh, Spunker here. Uh, Spunker R2. How much? 10.5. And then, they also have this Tosec Grand Fondo. This Grand Fondo is what size? 47. 47. How much? 13,000. And lastly, this is Tosec what? This is Tosec Grand Fondo. This one? t -Rich. Okay. So... Uh, I do apologize for that. We have some mixed up here. So because of the signage was here, I thought this was the bike. So my apologies. So this is Grand Fondo. This is T-Rich. How much is T-Rich? 22. Alright. And here, she has a lot of accessories here. Different accessories like drop bars, uh, bike locks, cables, gloves, uh, cogs, she has a lot of cogs here. And then, this is also the area for their workstation. So, they have duty mechanics here. Two duty mechanics. They sell rims and different accessories as well. So they have different hubs and uh, tubes as well. And, as I have said, they have a lot of beta, fra, uh, beta hubs right now here. So, it only costs you 3300 if in case you wanted to purchase this thing. And PD bikes... If you wanted to purchase PD bikes, it's also available here for your kids. If you wanted to give them bikes, so you may do so. And uh, how much is this one, Sean? Size 12. Size 12 is 2,000. This is size 16. How much? Size 16 is 27. This one is nice. If in case you want, you have some kids that you wanted to give gifts this coming Christmas. You may be able to contact them as well. And here, how much for late for girls? 27. And lastly, the color pink? Same. Same. It's 27. 27, 2,700, 2,700, 2,000. Okay. And they sell different helmets here. What is your cheapest uh, helmet here? Laminated, like this one. How much? Wow, 300, no? If you'll be saving like 10 pesos every day, so at the end of the month, you have 300 pesos, you may be able to purchase this uh, helmet, okay? So I think case for those people who are, you know, still biking without a helmet, please, you know, don't risk your lives on the road, okay?
try to purchase a helmet you know just to protect your head and at the same time you know that your wife and your kids are waiting for you all right so as much as possible always keep safe okay so now this is my latest uh, update today august 20 20 22 it's a saturday so if in case you wanted to purchase a bike here please try to contact my man here Sean. Sean, can you invite them here in your shop uh, hi guys, uh, please visit my store here in Sigi Street, Quezon Boulevard, Quiapo and um, try to contact me if you want uh, 0931029942 and that's me, Sean and Sean on the FB page uh, FB account and please subscribe to Dino Boy TV Alright, thank you very much Sean, uh, what time do you usually open your shop here in Quiapo, Manila? Uh, usually 8 uh, until 6 until 6 p.m. and then uh, what kind of uh, mode of payment do you usually accept in your store? Um, we have, um, uh, Gcash, cash and bank transfer. No right. installment. No yet. installment yet. Home credit and other credit cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, do you have any special shout out to your friends or to your uh, other relatives in Cebu? You may uh, talk to your native tongue if you wanted to. Oi, <laughs> mga bisaya niya. Subscribe na Dino Boy TV. Thank you very much. So that is the latest update here at Rides Bicycle Shop, Quezon Boulevard, Quiapo, Manila. Just in case you wanted to know all the necessary details, if you wanted to order here at Rides Bicycle Shop, you may see all the details at the comment section and also at the description page. Okay? You may contact these guys. If you wanted to purchase here or inquire, they also have a Facebook page, they have Messenger, and I will also put the mobile number if you wanted to purchase a bike here. Okay, so this is Sean, this is Elmer, and this is Ruel. So if in case you wanted to contact them, please do so, and uh, they will be able to help you with your inquiries. Okay, so to all my subscribers, please like, share, and subscribe, Dynaboy TV for uh, all my uh, latest bike checks and also for my latest uh, bike shop visits and all the different things about the cycling world okay what else uh, to all my friends in the different parts of the country like especially in uh, Lethbridge Canada so thank you very much for subscribing special mention uh, Michelle and Marvin Salway thank you very much for subscribing to my channel so now you may be able to understand me because now I'm speaking in your native tongue so, <laughs> thank you very much. What else to all my friends in Switzerland, in uh, New Zealand, especially in Hamilton. So, to all the Pinoy bike communities there in uh, New Zealand, thank you very much for uh, subscribing uh, to Dino Boy TV. And uh, special shout out to uh, Rox and uh, Jeff. Hi to all of you there, especially to the other uh, Filipinos uh, who are living in New Zealand, okay? Especially to those people in uh, United Kingdom, in uh, Saudi Arabia, in uh, United Arab Emirates, Poland, Iceland, Romania, Lithuania, Slovenia, Tajikistan, Uzbekistan, uh, what else? Uh, Japan, Thailand, Vietnam, Malaysia, Laos, Brunei, Darussalam, Filipinas, Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. Thank you very much for subscribing to Dynavoy TV. Till then, mga bayaw, this is Dynavoy TV saying, uh, peace out. Outdoor and cycling attire for MTV, the Trailman. Suave ang looks at matibay ang fabrics. Trailman has various design, fitted for biking and other fitness affair. Kaya sa rides mo, e Trailman mo. Designed and engineered by Manang Loaming Store, MLS, Trailman.